What's good? It's your boy TJ. Welcome back to the channel. Hope everyone is well. Today we are going to be doing a speed challenge. Yes, we are trading one of the prop firms challenges and we're going to see how fast we can pass it. It's going to be a crazy video. All of it's going to be live. So if you are new around here, subscribe and like the content. Let me know in the comments down below if you enjoyed it. And without further ado, let's go baby. Okay, so we've currently got sales open right now. Obviously, as you guys know, the markets have been crazy. The sales have been going off. I was trying to catch buyers, and obviously, I made a few profits here and there, closed early. But all in all, I'm staying out of the market at the moment because it's very, very bearish. But we currently are doing a speed challenge, as said at the start of the video, where we've got to try and pass a, an account within the quickest amount of time. Now, we are currently in, as you can see on the screen, sales at 17.11. This is all going to be live as well. I am going to catch re-entries into the sales because I believe we're going to sell off even more back down to around the 1700 level for sure. But I don't want to blow the account. Obviously, we're doing a challenge. I don't want to blow the account. It's a 10,000 challenge because I want to see how quick we can actually get and pass the account. Will it be insane if we could pass it within 15 minutes? Yes, it would be. Obviously, the technique I'm using, I wouldn't recommend because you're technically not entering in to a specific point in the market where you're getting the best entry in terms of it could retest back up to 1730. Probably won't, probably just continue down into sales all the way down to past 1700, probably even 1678, which is a major, major key level in gold. 1678 is crazy. Now, we're going to stay in profit on the account and we're just going to see how the market moves. As I said, this is a speed challenge. So we need to see if gold's going to sell off nice and fast. Fingers crossed market's moving nice because of New York Open. So fingers crossed we're going to see some big stuff. Obviously, we saw the 17, 19, 50 wick out. We can't go anything more than minus 5% because it is a speed challenge. We, and it also is a prop firm challenge account we can't go below five percent so fingers crossed the trade comes in nicely and we don't blow the account this could be a bad video or it could be a great video who knows but i just needed to i wanted to make some more content you know on the channel i wanted to make some more content on the channel because the fact is i can help you guys with the psychology the emotions talk about my experiences give you knowledge about trading i'm gonna make some more youtube channels up so we're gonna have a trading channel where i do chart analysis we're gonna have the main channel that makes forex content and all that flipping challenges and stuff like that i've got tjfx reacts at the minute that reacts to other forex youtubers in the industry in their content which is really really good and yeah tjfx shorts as well so we're gonna open up another one where i'm basically going to be doing loads of chart analysis, breakdowns on my groups, but also on the trades I take, you know, it's not always about advertising the groups, it's just the trades that I take day in, day out trading for it. So without further ado, we're currently minus 450 pounds. We're seeing on the one minute, five minute time frame right now. We wanna see it pass down within the next two minutes, sell all the way down to 17.07. Next hour, completely sell off. That is my prediction continue to sell off past 1708 so now we should just see sales the trades just running into profit fingers crossed i am correct i wonder what the fastest time is obviously if i caught the sales up here then we would have passed within a few minutes but i didn't i didn't i only thought about this idea just now so i was like yo do you know what get me a get me an account get me a challenge let's be running let's see how fast we can do it Obviously, this sort of trainer do not advise, but my analysis right now is that end of this hour, we're going to continue to sell down past 17.09. Trades run all in profit. We move SL to entry. We move SL to entry, and then we are all big chilling. That is, that's my prediction anyway. Fingers crossed. This 19, this 17.19 wick up was just a, you know, rejection. But yeah, we're going to see it continue to sell. If it rebounds off here in the next hour, then, you know, we could be we could be in in a bad way. We could be in a bad way. But we believe and trust the process. And that is the important thing about trading. You can't be too, 
you know, involved in all the noise on the one minute, the five minute, the 50 minute. You need to look at all of the overall. And I'll tell you what, this could be a massive wick out. Could be a massive wick out into buys here. But you know it's going to come down to 1700. You just know it's, it's going to go to that. It's going to go to that level. You just know it is. Has no choice. 100 pips and I pass. If it rejects here, then it will be buys all the way back up. And you know, it'll be SL, it'll be SL here because it's rejecting the body. But believe in yourself with trading. It's a speed, it's a speed run, it's a speed run. So you've got to take risks. You've got to take risks to get reward with trading. Obviously, I wouldn't advise doing this on a live account or anything like that. You know, for these challenges, it's okay. It's okay to do it on the challenges, it's fine. If you like this sort of content, let me know, like and comment down in the description if you want me to do some more speed runs. I could do some flipping challenges live. That would be quite fun to do, so let me know. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna have to see what happens. I'm expecting big sales, big sales fly into profit, baby. Big sales fly into profit, come on. Yo, I'm going all out by the way on this account. It's maxed this leverage, it's got nothing left. So it's all or nothing. It's literally putting up all your money on the roulette table. However, the, we've got one thing that is with us it's market direction, baby. One hour retest the body. Big sales back down. That's what I'm predicting. Big sales here now. Continue to sell in the bearish downtrend. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. Look at that. We're going. 1678 is a major key level, by the way. So if you're watching this content and it comes down to 1678, you're buying at 1678. Look at it. Look at the daily. We hit it three times last year. So let's see how many times we can hit it this year. You know. Come on, baby. Let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. That's what I want to see. I want to see some profits. Come on. Like I said, all the way down. Let's pass the account ASAP. Let's pass it ASAP. All the way down. All the way down we go. This is what I want to... Let's go, baby. Up 2%. 8% needed. Obviously, it's going to... Once it starts plummeting, that's when the profits are going to come down. When it comes down past 1706, oh yes, that's 11. That's going to be like, a, like I reckon we'll get like 1500 from this trade. Past breakdown, 1707. I can feel it. Slight rejection, but it's fine. Slight rejection, but it's fine, it's fine. Sometimes you got to get a bit of rejection. Just a little retest, you know? Just a little retest. Obviously, there's no SL on this. We're just going in for sales. The SL is the equity. The SL is the equity, so we're just going in for it. We was up 2%, now we're down 1%, 2%. So, this is part of trading, it's the emotion, but you gotta believe in yourself. Arguably, you know, I'm not saying that we've got the best entry, okay? We haven't got the best entry, but you just got to believe in the overall market direction. Plus, it is a challenge. It's a speed challenge during New York session. We can do this again, but for higher size accounts or even a live account. And, uh, yeah, we can just, instead of it being like a speed, speed challenge. If you guys want the risky speed challenges, then obviously let me know. But we could also do a whole day worth of just trying to pass in a day. And just record the whole day so let me know here we go baby we don't want this to come back up we don't want this to come back up we want this just to retest here and just continue to sell we just want this to plummet past the 1710 once it pump plummets past there we're laughing minus three percent minus three percent minus four percent Minus 5%, minus 6%, minus 7%, oh no, oh no, well I've lost it, I've, had, I've actually lost it, that's it, that's it, minus 9, minus 9%. God. Look at it go. Well, if you enjoyed this video and you want to see another 
challenge, then let me know in the comments down below. Obviously, that was uh, that was dreadful. Um, yeah, well, anyway, like and subscribe, join up all the groups, and uh, yeah, that's not that's uh, that's what's not to do when taking these challenges. Anyway. We'll go again with a proper analysis. If you enjoyed this video, like and subscribe. And I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.